Hello, my name is Shreya Skota and I am an Executive Director at C. Krishnaya Chetty & Sons. Today, I would like to talk to you about star sapphires and star rubies. These rare gemstones display an unusual phenomenon called asterism. Now, almost all gemstones we know contain other mineral inclusions growing within them and one of the most common inclusions are needles. This rutilated quartz clearly illustrates what needles are because it has large, eye-visible, rutile needles penetrating its core. However, the needles in this quartz are large, stubby and unoriented in nature. Now sometimes, and only under the exact circumstances, do we have thousands of fine, consistently oriented needles within a gem. And we call this silk. Now what happens when we have silk is that light reflects off these needles in particular directions and this results in a stunning play of light. This light blue Ceylon star sapphire displays a well-centered, high contrast, six-rate star. Stars also do occur in four and twelve rays. However, not all star sapphires are lucky enough to have such a well-centered star. For instance, this star ruby displays a star that is way off its center. And some people wouldn't even know it's a star ruby until after they cut the stone. And that would usually reduce its value dramatically. However, this particular piece is part of our estate collection and is an antique. Now all antiques at C. Krishnaya Chetty and Sons come with their own certificate of authenticity and this ring had its last record dated in about 1950. One of the biggest challenges that cutters face is which direction to cut the stone because they would have their ruby rough or their sapphire rough and they may not even know it's a star. So what cutters would do in the olden days is take a single drop of water and put it on the stone and they would do this in all directions and what they would realize is that in one particular direction they would see a star appearing on the dome of the water and that's when they would know it's a star ruby or a star sapphire and they would cut it in that direction. Now another thing to be wary of are synthetics. Yes, synthetics do exist in the marketplace. So if you do have a star ruby or a star sapphire or any star gem, do visit our gemologists and we can help identify and value your stone. Here at C. Krishnaya Chetty and Sons, we make star rubies and star sapphires available to you. Thank you.